So this video will hopefully give you some perspective as to what to be looking out for when purchasing a 3D crystal. Um, you might have heard about our company through some media profiles or perhaps you just stumbled on our website online. You've seen many companies offering 3D crystals. So what we decided to do was send a photo uh, to the leading competitor online um, and take a look at uh, what they sent us and compare it to what we produce so we could better understand um, have some competitive intelligence and also share with you um, what you need to be looking out for and really what the differences are. So the first thing I want to point out is the gift box. This is the gift box that we got from the competitor. Um, it's, it's a standard gift box. It looks quite nice. It's blue in color. It actually also has a, a sheen to it, like a, almost like a glossy finish, um, which isn't bad at all. Um, the one issue with the gloss is uh, that if you turn it to an angle, you can start seeing some of the um, uh, gloss drying up so it doesn't look uh, as good when you want to give it as a gift so that's something you want to be careful of so I guess the first point is make sure that when you're buying a, a 3D crystal uh, from any online company um, that you are aware of what the packaging looks like because the packaging is makes a big deal um, when you're giving it as a gift so uh, when we open it up um, you'll notice here that the crystal is embedded uh, in some foam. Now, what we really try to do in the industry is hide the fact that there's foam. You don't want the recipient to know that there's foam under here. Um, that kind of cheapens the whole product. So it's very important that the foam is properly covered. In this case, um, they didn't do the workmanship to ensure that uh, the foam was covered. So that's something that, you know, even if it happens to you when you receive a gift box, you can always tuck it in before giving it as a gift. But just to point out the problem, and also, of course, a lot of the loose threads here. So that's the gift box. Uh, nothing um, uh, nothing uh, too concerning, but uh, definitely uh, some room for improvement. Now let's take a look at the uh, crystal that came in that box. So this is an image that we sent to uh, the company. We intentionally sent an image that had a pet and uh, a child that was wearing a hat. Um, this is an image that um, we also use to create our own crystal. And I'll put our crystal here a little later on so you can compare them apples to apples. Now, um, what they've done is they've converted this to 3D. So if you turn it to the side, you actually see the 3D effect, which is really cool. It's, it's, uh, it's like a pull um, and it pops. Um, the crystal looks quite nice uh, in terms of the resolution when you look at it as a crystal on its own. Uh, when you turn it to the side, you'll start to see lines appearing. These lines are uh, referred to as striation, and um, it's a technique um, that many laser operators use for stretching or for pulling the image so that you get that 3D effect. Um, this is the technique that, you know, when we, um, as the founders of this product, uh, had first started, um, we were actually using this technique, uh, but we've since, um, you know, changed. We like to innovate and continue to offer better things, so we've changed the uh, the way that we um, uh, that we do 3D. So let me uh, show you uh, our product and how ours comes. I'll just move this to the side. So ours comes in a, a black gift box. Um, the gift box is actually covered with this um, sleeve, this black sleeve. So I'm just going to open it up. And inside the sleeve is the actual gift box. So we've intentionally um, not made it a, a glossy finish. We like the texture feel of the box, kind of the textured matte feel uh, of the box. On the front, we've uh, left um, an indentation here um, just because we think the seam looks quite cool. Um, so it's just paying attention to some of the small details. We've also um, placed a magnet in the uh, top of the uh, lip so that it attracts to the actual base of the box. Okay. When you open it up, you see um, our black satin cloth. And it is uh, quite well um, fixed to the interior. And then you see our crystal. So let me uh, now do the apples to apples comparison. So again, that was the what we received from the competitor. And now this here is our crystal. So when you put them side by side, now you can actually understand and see the difference in quality. All right. So this one here is not as high resolution as this one here. 
And remember that exercise where we turned this to the side and we saw the, um, the lines or the striation? If I turn this one here, you don't see it. We're, we're actually using almost a, uh, a baking technique um, to get this superior high resolution in the crystal. I mean, anyone can produce a 3D crystal. Really, what we're aiming to do is produce an HD 3D crystal. Um, another, another thing you can notice here is the uh, perimeter of their crystal is quite sharp versus ours. It has a facet or a bevel, so um, it looks quite nice as well. So, um, yeah, you, uh, I guess, do your homework, and uh, then you can decide where to buy from. Um, uh, what I could tell you about our website is, is that uh, we offer the best quality um, and at the best price. So, really, if you do find any other website that's offering the same size as ours, even if it's inferior quality, um, no worries. Just let us know. Um, send us the details of that website. We'll, we'll not only meet, but we'll beat uh, the price of that website uh, to ensure that you get um, the best quality and a crystal from the original founder and manufacturer of the product. I hope this video helps.